Playground. Hooray! This is the Black Lives Don't Matter podcast. <laughs> That's what I said. Black Lives Don't Matter. What kind of fuck up podcast is this? Black Lives Don't Matter? Really? Man, who is this dude? Black guy? Wait, so a black man got a podcast called Black Lives Don't Matter. It's like President Obama waving the rebel flag. I done seen it all now. Maybe this is what it takes. Time to shine the light on all the times black life didn't matter. Talk your truth, brother. Listen up. Let's get down with this. Because if black lives really mattered, we wouldn't need a movement. Now would we? For full episodes, subscribe to Black Lives Don't Matter, where you get your podcasts. Welcome back to the Black Lives Don't Matter podcast. I'm your host, Darren Harris. I've got a few things I want to unpack, so let's get right into it. Governor Greg Abbott of Texas pardoned a killer. Somebody just to, just that simple. A, a man who killed a Black Lives Matter protester. Now, I don't give a shit what your your feeling is about the the Black Lives Matter movement. I mean, I, I, I don't care what what your opinion of it is. You don't get to kill somebody because you don't agree with it. And you damn sure shouldn't be pardoned for killing someone. Unless, of course, the governor himself himself agrees with what you did. He's basically giving his blessing to this man who killed this protester that is a very low point in the history of our country as a yet another low point and another clear message to black america from the governor of texas that your life does not matter here and that is the truth you call it what you want to you can say I'm over exaggerating. You can say I'm par- you can say whatever the fuck you want to say. But the fact still remains that it is it is it's the truth. It is the truth. All right? Sleep on that shit if you want to. But it's the truth. Another thing is the airman that was wrongfully murdered in his apartment by two by deputies who stood out of the way of what a couple of cowards man I mean he was laid to rest I believe yesterday and peace be with you brother you know you are you were gone too soon and you were gone because two deputies went to the wrong house and shot a man as soon as he opened the door and so far, it's only been, what they say, <clears throat> it's only been um, an investigation. I haven't heard anything about any kind of arrests or any of that. But these men went to the wrong house. And they killed the United States airmen. Let that sink in for a moment, folks. Let that sink in for just a second. Now, I'm usually amped, <laughs> and I can't front the last podcast because I just did this a second ago, and I decided I was angry. <laughs> and I decided I wanted to tone it down a little bit just so I could articulate a little better what I was wanting to say without being so angry. But before that, I just want to say also, in Virginia, I think it was Virginia, they restored the names of some Confederate generals to some schools. Let that sink in for a moment. So all three of those things, the governor of Texas pardons a killer, a wrongfully wrongfully murdered airman, murdered in his home, they went to the wrong house, and the renaming of the confederate the schools with the names of the confederate the confederate generals and soldiers or whoever they wanted to put on these schools 
And that is sending a pretty clear and concise message to black America. And like I said in the beginning, just like the title of this podcast, black lives don't matter here. I don't give a shit about you. We will never give a shit about you. Think about that. Think about that. Think about that, man. And I know what my producer is going to say. You, you said think about that three, now four times. But I really do, man. I really want people to sit down and internalize the shit out of that. People are like, what are you going to do about it? Psh. What can we do? What can we do? There's a bunch of people. Greg Abbott just pardoned this guy. There's a bunch of people that are about to get pardoned that 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 took part in January 6th. A bunch of those people are about to get pardoned and let out of prison for their attack on the country. All right, man. Looks like I might need to leave. I might need to make some arrangements. Might need to go someplace else. Someplace where I feel safe. Because I'm sorry, I just don't feel safe here. I don't feel safe in America for a large amount of, for many reasons. For many, many reasons. I just don't feel safe here. Not only do I have to be worried about threats from overseas because we can't mind our fucking business, but I got to be worried about John the Redneck down the street who don't like me just because my car is nicer than his. This is the Black Lives Don't Matter podcast. For full episodes, subscribe to Black Lives Don't Matter, where you get your podcasts.